Happy last day of Buffalo Bills training camp to all who celebrate. The next time we'll see this team is in their preseason finale. Now, once that's done and over with, that roster gets trimmed from about 90 plus to 53. Seven Sports Director Matt Bovey joins us from Highmark Stadium to talk about the guys he think who shined and the others who underwhelmed. Hey Dom, so training camp has come to an end, so let's look back at some of the players who have either impressed or left me a bit concerned about the season. We'll start with the good. Greg Rousseau has been awesome all summer. I thought when they were in Rochester, he was their most impactful player. Then he backs it up with an even more impressive performance against the Steelers. He was out there for three series. He had two and a half sacks. He has been good all summer. I think a breakout season is on the horizon. Now, as for the position I'm the most concerned about, it's the wide receiver room. That's partially because of the injuries and also just because nobody has really stepped up and felt like the true number number one wide receiver. I think it's going to be Khalil Shakir by process of elimination, but still a bit concerned about that position. And then individually, Tyler Bass has been very inconsistent this summer in the games, which is far and away the most important. He's five for five. That's good. The bad, though, is that at practice, he has missed a bunch of kicks. So when this team actually is playing real games, they'll need him to step up. He certainly has the talent to do so. We'll see if he can bounce back when the regular season actually begins. So training camp, is now done. Only one thing left until we're in full regular season mode, and that's the preseason finale right here on Saturday. In Orchard Park, Matt Bovey, 7 Sports.